Well, g'day everybody and welcome back to Cyberpunk 2077. So, uh, oh, hang on, we'll be able to answer this. See, listen, I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. But you are not the, the number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now, that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds. But I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. That sounds pretty clear. Alright, so here we go. There are various yes, we know that. Alright, beautiful. Oh, I'm still having trouble um, trying to work out exactly. I don't know. I don't know what that was. I'm still. I'm still having a little bit of trouble trying to decide uh, what I am going to do in regards to uh, the content for this on YouTube. So uh, a lot of. I've done a lot of research and stuff like that. I'm just. I know that people are playing it. I know that people are posting it and stuff. But uh, what I'm concerned about is. Um, what I'm concerned about is uh, is obviously, you know, the, uh, the the whole adult content thing. So I don't know yet, guys. Uh, but anyway, we need to go and meet up with uh, we need to go and meet up with this dude here. Here we go. Uh, this is Dex. We are about to meet with Dex. And here we go. Ms. V. A pleasure. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> Let's roll. Mind if I ask you something right off the bangle? Would you rather live in peace as Miss Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory smelling near like posies without seeing your 30th? It's first place or no place, Dex. Cost isn't a factor. <laughs> Classic. I'd expect nothing less from eager, supple youth. Respect. All right, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scav home. Tell me more. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip, to be precise. Jobs to grab it. Simple. Biochip. Guessing it belongs to a corp? Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. Corps don't deserve special treatment. Yeah, not at all. Not Shit. at all. <laughs> you ain't playing around. Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of eddies. Well, thanks, Dex. You work this out. Got not a that I trust you. Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolving, then. Second, to rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. Hmm. Okay. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? It's a gang Maybe. Maelstrom, I'm pretty sure. Slot in the shard. All right, here we go. Let's stick this shard in and see what happens. a plastic tail for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a military convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the flathead, a little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high grade military tech. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate, one Simon Randall, AKA Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor. Royce is ugly. To add to this shitstrom, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. 
Who's the prima donna? Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter. So she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. Excellent. Client. What's her thing? This is the client Why that wants to meet up with it. Yep. Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. And the convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. Hmm. Think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. Excellent. All right. So I did notice when we uh, when we walked out the uh, when we walked out the door of the uh, uh, after getting our mods done that uh, the police all of a sudden have um, have little uh, yellow triangles over their heads or little yellow downward arrows. I'm guessing that we might actually be in strife um, with the police as well. So that's pretty interesting. That's very interesting indeed. All right, are you gonna uh, are you gonna let me out? Are you gonna let me out, guys? I don't know what that was. One more thing, Miss V. Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm? Blaze of glory, Dex. Blaze of glory, because that's how Simi rolls. Right, you gonna let us out or what? Later now. Thank you very much. Ciao. Nice to meet you. So now we're gonna need to avoid cops. Perform performing certain actions will reward you with street cred. Build your street cred to make a name for yourself in the Night City underworld. Doing so will open up new opportunities. All right, lovely. New contact added. Meredith Stout. Traveling around. Jackster, talk to Dex. Oops. <laughs> yeah, Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nine. Hmm, okay. Claim to want to check our pro cred. But to me, it feels more like he tangled us up with Maelstrom and Militech. Mm. There's this combat bot military prototype. Maelstrom clipped it, then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. I right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. About sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deeds of some Militech agent too, but don't know how much help she stands to be. <laughs> All right. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table, Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Hey, doing? Very cool Parker outfit. Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the number. He must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? Was first. Well, I think we'll visit the client first. Parker. What do you reckon? I think I ought to see her first. See what she's like, what she's after. Suss her out a bit. In that case, I'll hit the all foods and put my nose to the ground. Stick around. It's not a way to go. Alright, so that's the that's that part of the job completed. It looks like there's a job over there. What jobs do we actually have in our in our uh, journal? Uh, where are we? Uh, the gig, the gift. Uh, where are we? She's kind of a girl who... Yoko. Where are we? 
Ah, we're there. That's that job. All right. Okay, cool. Uh, what we might do is we might uh, track that job. Let's go back into character because we have some upgrades. Uh, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to upgrade this. Uh, let's see, bullet jock increases damage with rifles and submachine guns. I'm going to upgrade that. I do want to at some point. I, I want to. I do want to start um, upgrading. Um, Let's upgrade reflexes. I do want to start upgrading uh, breach protocols and quick hacking as well. So that's kind of what I want to eventually um, eventually concentrate on. The thing is that at the moment I just need to get some more damage, I think, on um, on my uh, on my uh, my gunplay. So that's that's what I'm doing now. Let's see. I don't know why that crystal decanter thing is. Is, uh, uh, let's see. Let's have a look at that message. Miss V, just wanted to remind you again that eddies have already changed hands between me and my esteemed Maelstrom partners in biz. A round sum of 10,000 to be precise. So when you're there to take it off their hands, don't let them try to shake you down as they're liable to do uh, Maelstrom being Maelstrom. Okay, so we'll answer thanks for the info. And we'll close that. And I don't know why that crystal decanter is stuck there. Uh, it's another message from Dexter. He loves us, doesn't he? You'll need it. Best of luck. Okay. Ah, uh, it's like those people who just reply. Okay, for absolutely no reason. Uh, let's see. We've got a GPS signal up there for where we need to go. So let's see if we can move up this way uh, across the road. That's a bit of a beast, isn't it? Must be the future Hummer or something. Uh, where are we going up this way now? Uh, I want to see if I can find anything else to pick up. So, looks like we found the last okay. honest cop in the city. Her name's Anna Hamill, and whatever she's investigating, it's made her a lot of enemies. She okay. She's best to cut it out if you catch my drift. Okay, look, I know how it sounds, but somebody would have taken this gig anyway, right? I don't know. Maybe there's an angle you can play here. Either way, info's attached. It's over here, markets. Uh, gig type, gun for hire. So these are gigs that this woman seems to be giving us. Uh, let's see. What's it say? Um, force Anna Hamill to drop her police investigation. Kabuki Market, which I think is where we are. Anna Hamill is a blue-blooded cop through and through, the kind you'd expect to see in some NCPD promo. Beautiful, smart, honest to a fault. In other words, a really bad fit for Night City. All her NCPD colleagues are another story. They all have back problems from sitting on fat wallets. <laughs> mm. This current case Hamill's working on has them all breaking out in hives. She's digging into the smuggling racket in Kabuki Market, which... If she makes any real headway, means bad biz for the cop buddy's finances, for her cop buddy's finances. They want someone from outside the precinct to nip this thing in the bud. Normally, that's where I'd leave it, but I want to add one more thing. I kind of feel bad for the girl. Rather, she not flatline if you can avoid it. Convince her to skip town or drop the case and make a career change at least. Okay, well, we will do that. We will track that job at some point. What I wanted to do is try and get rid of this crystal decanter thing, uh, which seemed to... Yeah, that's where we're going over there. Which actually seemed to pop up just before we got into Dex's car and seems to be stuck there. So, so let's have a look. Is there any junk that we can pick up? I know, I know that it's the other way, guys. I just want to see if there's any junk that we might be able to pick up lying around here somewhere that might actually get rid of that. Doesn't look like it. So it looks like it's going to be stuck there for a little bit. Yeah, what if we go into that view? No, it doesn't, uh, doesn't disappear either. I thought maybe if we just picked up another piece or something it'd get rid of it. But uh, let's see what we've got here. Alright, in we go. Uh, is, there, is there something here we can pick up somewhere perhaps? No, 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 no. Nope, nope. Can't even pick that up. All right, let's talk to this lady. Yeah, this is where T-Bug sent, sent us. Said you'd have something for me. You're V, right? Mm -hmm. She had me mm -hmm. hold the demon for you. It should work on any third-gen deck. 
Okay. Okay. Glad to grab a demon always. You could test it now. I have an access point. If you'd like, that is. You might extract some shim soft or subroutines. Seems worth a try, either way. Okay, so what is it? It's this one. Zero dollars. What else does she have here? Quest backup. Quick hack. Short circuit quick hack. No, uncommon. Yeah, it's a quick hack as well. Deals moderate damage to the target. Very effective against drones, mechs, robots, and targets with a weak spot. Let's sell off all of our junk. Confirm. Ah, maybe that will get rid of it as well. <gasps> it did. Uh, all right. So now what we need to do is we need to equip this. Uh, let's see. Inventory cyberware. Uh, I'm, uh, I'm guessing it goes in operating system and replaces. Yeah, it does ping quick hack. What's this? Cyber deck boss ram. Uh, two base RAM, four buffer size. They should perform quick hacks on targets and devices while scanning. Can you... Uh, I wish... I wish... I wish I'd get rid of that. Look, get rid of that screen. Oh man, some of these little bugs are just really annoying the crap out of me. Stalling a quick hack. Yeah, okay, we know that. So let us... Uh, Oh, no. So let us just uh, get out of it so we can actually see what we're doing. Thanks, game. All right, I'm just going to have to stick it in here by the looks of it. There we go. Just threw it in there as part of my uh, Militech Paraline Cyber Deck. So it's in there now. Okay, so hack. Now let's hack that. Uh, ping. We had to ping it, didn't we? So we'll ping that. There we go. Uh, there, okay. What else did it do? It did something else as well, didn't it? But it obviously wants us to go over here and jack in. Uh, access points are your way into local networks, allowing you to gather val valuable data that may yield rewards in some parts of the game. Jack in. Why not? <laughs> uh, okay, sequence 1C. 1C55. How do we do it? How do we do navigation? Now 1C. That one is. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Uh, I don't know. I don't know how to how to do it. Oh, it's only doing that line. Is it something that you have to? Hmm. Don't know. Uh, can we select 55 from somewhere? No. Uh, okay, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> well, that's not very intuitive, is it? Uh, let's see, 1C55. So this one has 1C and 55. Can we... C55, no. No idea what I'm doing. No idea. No idea at all. But I seem to I seem to have got what I was looking at. Uh, installed data mine amount of euro dollars components. Okay. I have no idea how I did that, guys. To be honest, I really didn't. I really don't. I mean. Uh, okay. All right. So that's that. Seems seems that's done. Uh, let's just get out of here. I'm going to have to figure that one out. Uh, what's the next mission that we're going to do? The next mission that we were going to do was uh, this cop. Uh, the gig. Look into that machine. No selling. Wait for the lockdown to end. Beat on the brat. Uh, no. Beat on the brat. Paid in full. Psycho killer. Oh, gig. Woman of La Mancha. I don't know many rippers who'd install Kuroshi Optics. Oh, that's paying back. Is that paying back? Uh, find Anna Hamill. Ask around the market. Yeah, okay, so we'll, we'll do that one there. Because the market, I'm pretty sure, is just over here. Yeah, I think it is. Which is where we were. Excuse me. Alright, so we need to... So we need to ask around. What have we got here? 
Tiger Claws wanted in Night City. Ward 10, 10 euros <laughs> for him. What about him? Uh, reward, uh, reward SC 60. So that's street cred 60 for when taking that guy out. Okay. Uh, let's see. Oh, loot. Got to grab this loot. Did we get it? Shotgun ammo. Lovely. Uh, what else have we got? Have we got any other loot? Who do we need to speak to? Uh, there's some data over here that we can grab as well. Come on, find it for me. Five big employers in Net City. I'm ready. You're ready. Uh, do we have anything that we can sell here? Read message. No, we don't want to do that. Do we have anything here we can sell? Oh, we've got plenty that we can sell. Uh, we can sell... What gun do we have equipped? I can't remember what pistol we have equipped. Uh, we have our pistol equipped. Uh, what can we do with our pistol? I wonder. It's a shotgun. Uh, I don't want to get rid of the assault rifle, but I, I'm, go I'm going to. Uh, I was going to keep one of these. I think they're both... I think they're both the same chemical damage, electrical damage, might do that one, uh, I just want to know before I, before I sell anything else, I, just, I would just like to know, there we go, we've got some money for that, I'd just like to know what we can, what we can actually do here, um, can we, how do we upgrade, alright, we can put a scope on there, we don't have any muzzles, uh, crafting, can we upgrade our pistol, uh, what do we need? Okay, we can only upgrade using that stuff, which means that we might just end up selling all of our pistols off. Uh, I mean, all of our uh, all of our excess equipment off. I think. Um, Dying night, rare and iconic. So we need epic item components, rare item components. But can we? Can we actually? Uh, let's see, inventory. Backpack, what do we got in our backpack? Can we actually... Oh, we can disassemble. Okay. No, so let's go there and hold Z to disassemble that. Let's hold Z to disassemble that. Uh, we've still got our shotgun on us and we will get rid of one of these. That's the electrical damage one. That is the physical damage plus eight, seven to nine physical that's four to five electrical so we'll get rid of that as well okay so that gives us some more components anyway so that's pretty cool uh what are we doing there we want to put that shotgun in there or do we want to put that in there i'm going to put that in there and with that one we're going to uh let's have a look in backpack we're just going to disassemble this shotgun i think as well so we'll do that all right, beautiful. Lovely, lovely. Uh, don't do that. Don't pull that out in the markets. There we go. Thank you very much. So there's we've got some experience points for crafting there. I'm just going to quickly save that game as a nomad. Yes, confirm. Thank you very much. All right. Uh, now we need to find somebody. Uh, photo. There we go. Okay, so she's got fresh shrimp and stuff. Nice. Nice. This is going to make me hungry. It's like streaming again when everybody's making me hungry. Uh, can we ask her? No. Is there anybody else? This dude had a picture over him. Uh, let's see. You with the El de Caldos. This is a good way to start a conversation. We're, we're both nomads. Got a room in this year's hotel. 
right over there. Oh, beautiful. Thanks. Don't mention. Nice work. Nice work. Uh, let's see. What can we do to her? What's she? She's uh, abilities, combat, stim, weak to fire. 36 street cred on her. No. Wow, it does civilians and everything. Uh, where, where, he's, he pointed up there somewhere, didn't he? Oh, it looks like we're going that way. Dude. Hey, Check you. out the bucket hat. Hey, break a hundred for me? What am I, a bank? Got any, uh, oh, I want to pick some junk up. I need junk. All right, let's, uh, oh, look, there's some junk. A record, a vinyl record. Let's pick that up. Uh, all right, let's, uh, 151. You serious? Well, access granted. That was expensive. Uh, read message. Z. Uh, we're delighted to welcome you as our newest guest. Your room number is 203. We wish you a pleasant stay. This is an automated message. Please do not reply. Should have replied to it. 203 would be on the second floor, wouldn't it? That would be 203. Ah, okay. It looks like she's upstairs. Is she upstairs? Are we? Oh, Hello. Uh, uncommon item components and bounce back. Let's just grab that. This looks like it's a... Uh, uh, if an attribute requirement appears in red, it means your attribute level is not high enough to perform an action. Use technical ability, not not enough. Hmm. Can we get in here? Can't get in there. Uh, can we get in here? No. All right. It makes me think we're going to need to climb. I think we're going to need to climb, guys. By the looks of it, which is why the game put us in here, I reckon. What's that? Hello, money. Come on. Ah, thank you very much. Euro dollars. Uh, yeah, okay. Uh, there and there. Oh, there were two things in that. What else have we got? Loot. Lots and lots of loot. 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 Did we just get a jacket of some sort? Uh, let's see. Is there anything else here? There. Yeah, loot. Loot. God, drip coffee maker. Yay. That's all we needed. All right, game finished. <laughs> That's it. We found a coffee maker. That is all we needed. Did we just get something? Uh, we just get a new jacket. No, I thought we picked up a jacket. I thought it was a jacket lying on there. Uh, can we hack into here and get our hundred and fifty-one dollars back? Let's have a look. Uh, let's see. Uh, BD fifty-five one C. BD 551C. Uh, BD. What, really? How did we fail? Uh, 1C. Failed 55. I am useless. I am useless. Now we are locked out of there. I have no idea how to do that, guys. Uh, is there anything that we can take in here? Surely there's something somewhere. Take the shampoo. Looks like we can't get that. That's what I hate. I mean, like, why can't you pick that up? Seriously? Hmm. Right, uh, there's something in here to take. Coffee with sin milk. Or sign milk. Okay. Uh, let's see. She's up there. Anything out here? Uh, is there really? No. But there was okay, so it's obviously up here. Hmm, that looks a bit dangerous. So it's it's in there that she is, I reckon. I was saying she was right up. Yeah, there she is. She's got the yellow thing over her head. Oh, hello. What's that? What did we get there? Uh here we go. Confront Emma Anna Hill. 
Okay. Not one more fucking step. Who put out the hit? Give me a name. Uh, here to warn you, I can tell you who to Anna, me. drop this investigation. It's in your best interest. That a threat? I'd remind you, you're the one in the fucking crosshairs. Excuse me. Yeah, that was a threat. Just want to help you. Just want to hey, help you. Easy. We we'll go Just the easy help. approach. Help? Phonic implant must be fried. I think you men intimidate. Just to end your investigation. Really pissed off the wrong people. Which people? Tell me what fucking people. Doesn't matter, or your buddies. <laughs> let's let's tell her the your truth. Buddies at the NCPD set you up. Fucking. I fucking knew it. Robert Kowalski and Bill Adams. Motherfuckers. Let it go. It's not worth it. You're angry. You're angry. Yeah. You know what? I'm not letting scumbags get me killed. Fuck them. Fuck this job. Fuck this city. Thanks. Thanks. All's well that ends well. Give me a break. Well, Don't act terribly sorry. Fuckers who sent you here. No, I just saved your life, you woman. You wanted, now fuck off. Okay. Not not before I loot this green thing. Max Doc Mark One. Got and nothing to say to you, Chum. Hmm. Is there anything else? Mm-hmm. Some more there. Ah, oh, yes, hello. Pistol ammo, yep, always looking for pistol ammo. Is there any money anywhere? You know what? She was nasty. She was quite nasty. Leave the leave the area. I thought there was something in the toilet that we could have looted. Is there anything in here that we could loot? No. Oh yes. There we go. Beautiful. Uh, nothing else. Alright, let's get out of here. There we go. Let's uh, leave the area as per request. Uh, I feel like $151 is it's an absolutely absolute waste of money for that. What's this over here? Use technical ability. Oh, hello. Is there anything we can get in here? So my technical ability was four. You know what we could have done, don't you? We probably could have hacked her door. Could we have hacked her door? Messages, local network. Uh, local network, turn off, remote takeover. Connect two devices, surveillance system. Ah, uh, so we could have turned the... Uh... Oh, hello. Wow, that's pretty cool, isn't it? On the surveillance system. Now I'm just messing around, aren't I? Uh, next device. So it does the whole market. Oh, does that mean that we can... Oh, yes, it does. Oh, insufficient RAM available to... Oh, bugger. Oh, what about him? Surely we've got... No. Damn, I wanted to try and hack them from here. We're really going to need to do something about this hacking. Nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing there. Back there again. All right, let's get out of here. Oh, no, not that one. Exit is C. Alright, so I could have turned off the... Oh, hello. Uh, E305 Prospector looks like a... Uh, looks like a, uh, a scope, so that should be pretty cool. Okay, uh, oh, can we try and hack in here? I really have no idea what I'm doing. Uh, BD and 1C. Oh, crap. Uh, 1C and BD. No. I don't know what I did. I just don't know what I did. Like, that's... Mm. Right, I'm going to have to learn how to do that, I think, guys, to be honest. I reckon I probably have that training protocol up anyway. Uh, open that. Failed to open that door. Use technical ability. Can't do that. So it's, it's probably, it's probably going to be financially viable to concentrate on... Um, to concentrate on uh, doing, um, can we hack that again? Yeah, it's probably going to be financially financially viable to concentrate on uh, increasing your hacking skills. I reckon. I did miss something here? Gas mask, recon grenade, hazmat suit. Yeah, no worries. Uh, hazmat suit. 
Bounce back. Euro dollars. 1,744 Euro dollars. I like that. We can get into here again. Let's see what we can do. Uh, we want to do 1C, 1C, 1C. Yep. Let's see. Why won't it? See, it won't let me. It only lets me do that. Like it won't let me, I don't know, I don't understand how to, how to go up and down in this. If I knew, if I knew how to go up and down. It's saying move the mouse for navigation, but like, uh, let's go into H for help. Uh, select the character from the highlighted row or column and press to send it to the buffer. Your objective is to select characters from the code matrix in the correct sequence in order to upload the desired program to the network. Yeah, that's fine. So we could do 1C, 1C, but there is no 1C, 1C. And all it's giving me is 55s and stuff. Uh, this is the list of demons. Uh, and press that. So select the character from the highlighted row or column and press that to send it to the buffer. So we want to do 1Cs, 1C, 1Cs. It still doesn't, still doesn't kind of make sense to me though. Let's see. Uh, 1C. So we send that one. Uh, 1C. Okay, so we installed two, small amount of, uh, and a moderate amount of Euro dollars. Okay, cool. Oh, I need to work that out. 300 euro dollars there. So we've got two, 2,000. It was worth coming back in here. Let's see if we can get out of this area. Uh, how do we get out through here, I think? By the I'm looks ready. of it. There we go. Pass these guys here. I don't know whether these guys are going to recognise us. There you go. Job complete. Gig. Woman of La Mancha. Uh, let's uh, talk to Regina again. Excellent. Please send me some money. Yes, 3,700 for that. Uh, Zed, who's that from? Uh, Bart Moss Collective. First will come the great reality check, which ushers in the future of the world. I have no idea what that means. But uh, for now, guys, for now, I am going to leave this episode here. I hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, hit like. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, definitely subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to come and follow us on Twitch and on Facebook and uh, join our Discord. We will see you next time. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.